Hey, 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 hey guys, my name is Simi Bro, and today I'm going to show you a first step to import your first object into Meta Horizon. We're going to go the basic, meaning getting an object, put in material, and import it into Meta Horizon. Um, so let's get started, and that's the basic of it. I'm going to explain what is Horizon looking for when you import a object. FBX file with a material that is the focus because that's the most important one we're gonna go ahead and use this default avatar that I have here in blender this is the size of our avatar um, so I'm gonna just go ahead and add a one texture in here as you can see if we come over here to the right which is material there's already one default um, texture on that I'm going to go ahead and just leave it how it is, but I am going to change the white to red. Um, let me change this to viewport here. So now that that's red here, it should be go to go. So this is going to be a basic uh, object that's going to receive light, uh, basic color, and that's it. So after we have our name and our color, we're going to go ahead and save this uh, file here. Uh, material as we need a, a material so this is the UV of this object here because we don't have no materials no materials on it we have to create a new one so we're gonna go to new and right here it needs to be the same name of the material so I'm gonna go ahead and copy that so I'm gonna go ahead and get new and name the name of the image so in this case it's gonna be that name of the material underscore br and the br it's what horizon is looking for it to uh, to attach to the to attach to the object and to identify what type of material it is if it's roughness if it's basic color is it see-through uh, all of the options that horizon have given us uh, so we need to add br on the image when we save it and if i save it right now like this it's going to be black because uh, that's the color that the uv image will have but i want it to be red so i'm going to go ahead and switch this to go up here and then switch this to red leave everything else how it is and then image and that should be this should be red to here um as you can see now i'm going to leave everything how it is here i'm just going to go ahead and highlight everything by pressing a then go into image save as and we're going to go ahead and save this to a folder that you're working on on a project um so save it where it needs to go in this case i'm just going to go ahead and save this here go ahead and save this here we're going to save that png file um and again this is the name that we save uh we put on the same when we we're saving that image so that should be good to go there i'm going to say save as now we go back to the layout up here and we're going to go ahead and save this file or this avatar so file export uh, fbx and save it where you just saved your first uh, image uh, material um, and again you can call this here whatever you want um, this is just the name of the file um, let's going to go ahead and call it see me bro here um, and you can call it whatever you want in here and then I just to make, I usually just go ahead and select the object that I'm saving on uh, if you're working a different like a lot of objects in the world but I just you just want that a specific um, object you can just select it and press select object here um, and you just select mash um, or you can just leave everything else but I'm just want to mash here um, we're gonna go ahead and Z forward um, unhighlight this we don't need to bake animation uh, after we have this here so to limit it to select object type of ob object type is it's gonna be a mash uh, everything sh and then the forward Z forward um, should be good to go everything else let it be how it is export that now I have those files we're gonna go into horizon here I'm gonna go ahead and import those files we're gonna come over here and go to add new 3d model because it's an object and a texture um, 
choose your files make sure you choose the files that you just saved so I have the files here so I'm gonna go highlight the FBX file the FBX file and the image texture PNG file import those uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and take that off real quick and then import and I'm just saving it onto my default assets um, so it, as you can see it is doing it's going through the process of uploading it into horizon and it was successfully so now we're gonna go ahead and right click on it and place it or you can just drag it whatever is easier for you uh, and here we go this is the avatar that we just worked on and put a texture to an object the same method that we just did is the same method that you need to do with individual objects that have textures uh, but this is uh, one object with one texture there is a video that I did earlier this a month that you can import mul uh, multiple texture with one object and that will save a lot of space in horizon but yeah here we go this is the one object uh, how to import into horizon this is the process that you need to go and do to import into uh, horizon so see you in the next one uh, let me know what kind of tutorials you guys want so I can help you speed the process so you can get where all, all of this creators at with great world and import and stuff like that. So let me know what you want to learn. Um, see you in the next one.